Welcome back, folks, to Farm Sim 20 at 22. I'm all jacked up on Mountain Dew. We got to kick a tire. Get your overalls on. We got some work to do. Now, you can see last time we 16.4. We got to remember 14.5 now. So he's 2,000, but honestly, that was only half of things. So we're going to see... 14.5, and we'll actually do the real math of what it actually is. Now, this isn't going to make as much money as the one we had. We had a different log place in uh, No Man's Land series, and we made like 30000 off of it every month or every day. I don't think that's going to happen. I think, honestly, we're going to be looking at... Um, yeah, I'm not sure. We got two pallets. Is that all that's in there? Let's see. On the bottom right, planks, wood chips, furniture. Okay, so furniture hasn't even came out. And it is March. Before we go sell this, let's take a quick look. At con There's no contracts. Game. You're killing me here, Smalls. It might have been an update that may have messed that up. And let's look for what's on sale. I haven't even checked myself. Ooh. Ooh. That's... Hmm. Yeah, I don't think we can use that trailer but it that is kind of cool i will say though if we run across another bobcat on sale uh maybe look for a slight upgrade in tractors here eventually we've had the summer tractors for a while we're gonna start keeping more of a close eye on that also um at some point too we may buy a new cell point to get it closer to the farm I'm going to show you guys something here that can make this cell point a little bit hard. Alright, so come over here. And I think I brought you with before on a sale, but we have this little narrow passageway. And if we're trying to do anything productive, oh crap. You can see how this just becomes a pain in the rump. Oh, and the trailer's no clipping through the truck that's beautiful all right so oh so we may at some point in the future here make a new cell point guys um i do like having some up here but i feel like the sell everything one that we use quite a bit kind of for our monthlies we may actually want to put that closer or somewhere we can get to it a little bit better than kind of what we've been doing. Alright, let's see what we get here. Three. Ooh, I was hoping to get a little bit more moolah today. Hmm. Alright. Duly noted, we have four grand. As you guys know, it's March. That means planting season has started. In today's goal, um, let me just grab this seed thingy doodler here. I don't know why I, oh, well, we, we done messed that up. All right, well, we'll grab this one for right now, and hopefully that'll stand that other one back up. Um, kind of. Perfect. I mean, that's about as, uh, professional as it gets right there all right um my goal today is to get the potatoes going all right are you gonna oh you are gonna fill off of that okay well we're gonna leave that there just in case hmm and let's go over to the potato field so we're at the potato field with the white knight and you can see everything is good to go. We just do need to plant it. We have some rocks here, but I think these can be rolled this year um, yet before we need to pick them up. 
We probably will need to pick him up next year. Let's go ahead and lower this bad boy. Uh, does it just turn on? Oh, yeah. Okay. That's freaking fancy. Um, does not look like it's super fast. I forgot about this planter. Uh, that being said, let's pop out and see what it needs afterward. Oh, okay, so fertilizer is definitely going to be our next step. I didn't know if it had enough or not. And I think, guys, we're going to do a little seedy up bit here. That used almost everything perfectly <laughs> um, out of the planter. Let's back this up. Oh, right there. Oh, all right. There we go. We'll top her up before we put her back. Uh, well, it's not fully topped off, but that's what we got for right now. And also, we needed to... Oh, our rollers are in the back, aren't they? So we're gonna have to we're gonna have to grab them. Yeah, the cultivator's in front of it. Hmm. Maybe I'll put the cultivators in front of that animal trailer. And I think we may look at possibly possibly getting a new fertilizer spreader today as well. These are a good set of rollers. I forgot that we got these good rollers. All right, let's head over there and uh, roll the field here quick. Moment of truth. Let's unfold these rollers here. I kind of want to see if these uh, stones, if you're wondering what I'm thinking about, I'm wondering if these stones are all going to go back into the ground right now. But that does take a little bit to unfold. Let's lower. Are you are you lowered? Looks like you're lowered. All right, let's see if these trees are in the way. I cannot wait to get rid of them. Oh, okay, it does look like it is, in fact... Putting them back in. All right, I'm gonna do the rest of this. See if all the stones go under. Yeah, actually they did. However, I don't think we're gonna get away with that again next year. I think next year when we go ahead and plow that, we're gonna have to get a stone picker or a an actual stone picker for that. I actually think we have the stone picker bucket, which. Honestly, that'll probably work if we don't have the cash to upgrade. But we do need to go ahead and put this back right there. We're going to tuck it right up on the side here. We're trying to make some more room in here. Um, You know what? Huh. That's got fertilizer in it. Hmm, let's take a look quick. I'm going to bring you with two, and we're going to look at maybe getting a new spreader. It's got to be cheap enough, and also it can't be huge for the back. That one might work. 600 liters, is there any smaller? 250, ooh. Oh, okay. All right, and it's cheaper. Um, that to seven meters at two hundred. That does ten meters at six. 
10 meters at 6, 7 meters at 4. Hmm. This is a safer bet. Crop catch drill. Um, spread disc cover. Okay, there we go. Gearbox. Now, let's have this bad boy. Uh, do we want a seat back there? No. Um, reflectors. Yes. Toolbox flap. I'm not seeing. Oh, it's up there. No, we want it open. We want dirty old tools. New old. Really? Oh. I have a funny feeling that, that first letter should have been P, not K. Ooh, and we can... Ooh. 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 I like it. Yeah, painted it. I think we're going to go with this one. We can always upgrade later, guys. Um, and this one can do lime, but only holding 200 liters is not going to be good. This one could only hold fertilizer. You never know. We might be able to, down the road, upgrade again as well. Let's detach that, and let's go get our new guy and get him over by the field. Well, before we do that, we actually have to go ahead and fill this thing. And granted, this isn't going to be the best fertilizer spreader in the world, but like I said at the beginning of this series, we're going to have some big steps. Or some little steps, not just, ah, uh, not just. Let's keep it up at the top of the fork this time. Oh, I may have to get a bag lifter. Oh, I actually, I think we have one. I will fill it there. But like I said, guys, in the beginning of the series, not every day are we gonna get a huge harvest. Oh, I don't have one. We're gonna have to buy one. Uh, front loader tools, we want a bag lifter. Oh, that's $700. That was as expensive as a spreader. So when we do get new stuff like this, it's going to be super kind of cool and interesting to test out. So let me go grab the other baggy thingy doodler of justice. We are over here at the field. I did just bring this over, the fertilizer over, in case we do need to refill. I don't think we're going to need to on this crop, on this small of a field, but you never know. There we go. We got 200 liters left, enough to perfectly refill it. And let's turn this bad boy on. Let's see. Um, oh, it needs to be unfolded. All right, are we good now? Oh, okay, so it... Oh, wow, this thing is actually very quick. Oh, all right, and it's... Oh, it's a little squirmy. You know what? This is way quicker than our old one. I don't know how I feel about this. We may have to get another one. I don't feel like it's supposed to be able to go that fast <laughs> it might be the world's fastest fertilizer spreader in the world oh and we're fertilizing everything ah <laughs> oh yeah um hmm i don't know how i feel guys <laughs> you have to let me know down in the comments <laughs> Uh, I'm pretty sure that said four miles an hour working speed, right? Let's make sure we're not crazy. Four miles an hour. That was closer to 45. <laughs> that was, my whole tractor could just go as fast as it wanted to. Um, hmm. Yeah, we might get another one down the road, but it is what it is, and we got the potato field done. It, the, another thing about having the fertilizer spreader is that 
We at least have one thing for lime, the old fertilizer spreader. Let's switch over. The old fertilizer spreader can be just on lime now. And I think we may upgrade, or maybe not upgrade, but maybe get away from a broken fertilizer spreader and then just have a lime and fertilizer spreader. But anyway, guys, I've rambled too much. It's the end of the episode. We got our potato planting done, though. I'll see you next time, folks. Have a good one.